We live in a media arts world, a world infused with media arts tools, forms, and experiences. This is how we learn and know about our world. It's how we communicate, interact, and share experience. Media arts is at the center of our global digital society. These are our new literacies, and all students should be a proficient in them so they are prepared for the society and for the future. And yet, media arts literacies are not commonly taught in schools. Media arts is not an official subject area. Teachers are not trained in media arts, and the curriculum doesn't normally address our media-infused culture or even media literacy. Media arts is unlimited in its creative capacity. Students can produce anything imaginable through these diverse forms of photo, video, sound, animation, film, 3D design, interactive design, and virtual design. If we put this innovative virtual laboratory at the center of schools, it could transform learning and the educational system as a whole. Instead of passively receiving information from teachers day after day, which is the standard practice, students could be engaged in, in exciting projects that they could direct themselves about issues that are relevant to them. These projects can then integrate all of the core subjects. This way, the core academics, such as math and language, are actually applied in real-world situations that mean something to the students which would give it context and connection and would deepen the learning. For example, if students produce a video about global warming, they need to carefully study the topic and translate it into their own words and images. They need to brainstorm about how to explain global warming. They synthesize their ideas and collaborate. They envision the video, they organize the project they create storyboards, they write and read scripts, planning their production, they act out the production, produce graphics to visually explain information, they rehearse their script to make their statements clear, all around the concepts of global warming. In short, they are mastering the concepts of global warming through this multimodal production process. Media arts production is a multimodal cognitive process. This process causes students to view the content through a new multimedia lens, incorporating all of the senses. They're translating their ideas through multimedia. They're also mastering teaching others through multimedia. Thus, they're actually mastering the learning process itself. These students are learning to learn, which is the ultimate outcome for schools. Therefore, if the Media Arts Virtual Laboratory is at the center of the school system, the entire system becomes focused on and redesigned around this more effective and enriched learning process. This learning process is more natural and is cognitively rounded or holistic because it incorporates all of the senses and a diversity of processes and activities. Our cognition is based in the senses because the brain integrates sensory input into meaning. Just like the multimedia production process which integrates sensory elements into meaning. Therefore, media arts production reflects the natural learning process. Media arts is multimodal and incorporates all of the arts. The arts are fundamental to developing robust sensory and neural networks. Young children learn and develop cognitively through multimodal play, which reflects all of the arts, incorporating vision, sound, movement, and acting out. Our multimodal cognition is why research shows that students learn more through multimedia experiences. Furthermore, with these creatively unlimited media arts tools and transdisciplinary projects, students can begin to solve the problems of our world. 
They can redesign cities to become more sustainable, pedestrian friendly, and attractive. They can engineer transportation to be more energy efficient. They can become more active and knowledgeable within their digital democracy. They can create social media campaigns to address media literacy and disinformation. They can create simulations and interactive environments for any particular learning goals. They can redesign schools around the principles of multimodal learning. Ultimately, students of media arts are empowered to create their own worlds. Thank you.